is changed. He belongs to the Dark Lord. Your time has come, Nazgul. You will not kill me again. to kill you. That will not happen. You should have died. Calabrembo deceived you, as he deceived me. Sauron. I serve Middle Earth. I may wear a Sildu's ring, but I am not yet a Nazgul. Shelob saw the future that has come to pass. She saw the great eye above Baradur. And she also saw the need for a counterbalance. Are you that counterbalance? No. We are. I was sent here to kill you. You once told me that in the war against darkness, stalemate is victory. Do you still believe that? I believe Mordor and the Nazgul must be contained. But how long can you fight this war before you fall and join them? I don't know. So perhaps you should stay close. Come. Look. After the Witch King's fall, an attack commenced against multiple fortresses. And by who? That is what we need to find out. As one power falls, another one rises. That is the way of Mordor.
This fort would not withstand an attack of ghouls. It's not the ghouls that concern me. My lordship. Attacks have commenced against the other forts. We must prepare. This is unfortunate. If attack now, we will fall. What has happened? Azran's departed a week ago to avenge his blood brother. He took his drakes with him. We have not heard from him since yesterday. Thrak was poisoned. He confronted Ahisu, who denied responsibility. <laughs> Thrak, perhaps deranged by poison, stabbed Ahisu, who then bled to death. It's a wonder you've been able to hold the fort as long as you have. We won't hold it at all without reinforcements. No, uh, I may know a few orcs who could provide the defenses we need. They are unique. Very well. I must attend to the fortress in Saragost. Saragost? Whereas you now wear the ring. I will not dominate these orcs. But I will bring them back. One way or another. This should be interesting. With every hour you wait, he falls further into darkness. You sent me to kill Nazgul. I will do what is needed when the time comes.